just for kicks and giggles, I'm gonna stand right over here. <laughs> Let's see what happens. I just heal up immediately. It's ridiculous, okay? I'm gonna try standing in front of the train with this glitch. Three, two, one. So right now inside of Jailbreak, there is a glitch that lets you get pretty much infinite health god mode inside of this game, alright? It's absolutely ridiculous, it requires two players to do it and also the mobile garage, but trust me, it's 100% worth it. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do the glitch here with my alt account and myself here. I'm gonna have like the, my main account on the left side, alt account on the right side so you guys know exactly what to do. You also need a 90,000 cash for the ambulance or the ambulance if you already have it. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so as you can see over here, I have both of my accounts. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do my right account over here, this is the alt. I'm gonna go ahead and spawn in the ambulance, okay? Now the ambulance is very, very important and you'll see here why. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead, you see, right here this is my old account here not my username is this it's currently inside of the ambulance here or in the uh, driver's seat and my main account over here is uh, inside of the uh, stretcher in the back now I'm just gonna go ahead and just circle around here wait like about a minute or so because I believe that's how long it takes for the uh, regeneration thing to uh, time out but basically what you want to do is just keep on loop spawning ambulances until you get like 10 of them stacked in a row it'll take about like 5 to 10 minutes to do the glitch but once you have the glitch working it should work for a really long time, unless you team switch, okay? So don't even think about team switching whenever you, you do this, okay? And I'm not sure if it'll prevent against getting arrested. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and just jump out my alt account. I'm gonna leave my main account inside here. And I'm gonna go ahead and come on over here and spawn myself an ambulance again. Wait zero seconds, and boom. Now, whoa, my alt account just fell out of the map. That was really strange. But you can see my main account here is just lying down. And if I come over here to my main account, I'm gonna go ahead and just jump out and go shoot. And you can see that the health is slowly regenerating, okay? You can see I'm gonna shoot down quite a bit of the pistol, but you can see it's slowly regenerating all this health here. Now, that's kind of what we're gonna do. Except, it's way too slow. If you're running into like the presidential ball just like blindly, you're probably still gonna go oof. So that means we're gonna go ahead and come over here and do this again. So on my main account, we get back into the stretcher, alt account comes over here, and we go to the uh, ambulance, respawn the ambulance, my main account's still glitched, jump out again, same thing to alt account, I'm gonna just come over here, you can see I'm gonna shoot the pistol, and now you can see it regenerates twice as fast. But twice as fast isn't quite enough. I'm gonna just uh, skip forward until we do it like five times or something like that, and I'll show you the result. So just did the glitch about five more times, and now I'm gonna go ahead and show you how much damage and how fast I re- like, uh, you know, regain health and stuff like that. You can see I'm shooting my main account with the pistol, and it's basically infinite health, okay? You look at this. I'm pretty much healing immediately after getting shot. There's like no way any amount of police officer is gonna be able to oof me, okay? There's, there ought to be like 13 cops or something to get me to go oof. I'm not sure if it will work against like the train or something like that, I'll put like a bunch of those tests there at the very end, but I'm gonna go ahead now, get a bunch of people inside of my game and tell them to shoot me down, and I'm gonna see how they react to this. So what should be the very, very first store we should go rob? Probably the jewelry store. Now I'm gonna go ahead and just like straight up walk right through the lasers without taking any damage. Okay, you can see I'm at full health again. Just gonna casually come over here and we're gonna rob the jewelry store. Okay, you can see look how fast I'm healing up. This is absolutely insane. Okay, the reason why I said no arrest is I believe you're still like uh, vulnerable to arrest. Okay, you can't just like, you know, not get arrested unless the steam breaks the cop's handcuffs, which happens to me all the time. Okay, I like, I don't understand why that happens. It's like a random glitch. Hopefully a steam fixes it in this uh, update that's coming soon but anyway you can see i'm just uh standing in the lasers like i'm just gonna walk right through and immediately heal up okay look at that it's absolutely insane i think i have like about eight or so of the uh, things stacked right now but i'm gonna go ahead and just casually walk through the jewelry store like literally carelessly okay this is as careless as you can get inside of this jewelry store <laughs> you can't get any more careless and i'm still at full health it's absolutely insane all right i'm gonna keep on just coming all the way over here look at this no damage. Well, actually, I take some damage, but I instantly heal. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just come on over here. I'm gonna get a bunch of people to try to oof me. All right, look, they're all trying to oof me. They're literally all trying to shoot me down right now. But look how fast I'm healing. It's absolutely ridiculous. There's no way any of them are gonna oof me, okay? Like, literally no way. I'm literally just gonna stand here. Look at them. 
And of course, somebody arrests me. I'm pretty sure if you get arrested, it does not reset. So, uh, yeah. Alright, let's see. Somebody come to the prison trying to oof me. Now, because I can't use the team switch menu or else it resets, I'm gonna have to manually walk all the way over here. And I'm just gonna see. Okay, somebody punched me, okay? I'm just gonna say, punch. And you can see here still, when people are punching me, my health is instantly going back to maximum. So that means even after you get arrested, it still works. Okay, this guy's gonna go over here and try to oof me, okay? A little bacon hair with some salad hair on as well. Go ahead, try and oof me. <laughs> just gonna say, everybody, get your guns out. <laughs> try to oof me right now. <laughs> okay, come on. Okay, you, uh, this guy with a shotgun. <laughs> Literally impossible to go oof. Literally impossible. <laughs> Here we go, boys. To the bank. Opening up the stairs to Min Vault. Min Vault's kind of easy. I kind of wanted it to be Presidential Vault, but that doesn't really matter. You can see, I'm just gonna go ahead and just casually walk right through the bank. No jumping whatsoever, and I survive. Normally, I would have oofed at, like, some point over here, but I'm just gonna casually just, you know, just goof around here. I'm gonna stand in front of the vault. Yeah, you know what? Just for kicks and giggles. I'm gonna stand right over here. <laughs> Let's see what happens. No impact. I just heal up immediately. It's ridiculous, okay? Let's see. Get herself 4,500 cash, and then we're gonna get outside. I just told the cops to just stand here and uh, not do anything. Hopefully they don't bust me because uh, this glitch doesn't protect you from arrest. It's kind of like Mad City as well. Mad City's God Mode only prevents you from taking any damage. It doesn't stop you from getting arrested. And while I wait for the bank to finish, what you guys should probably do is hit subscribe, turn on notifications, and use code BACON. Because, like, obviously you should use code BACON. And you can see here, everybody is getting oofed by the police officers. And I'm still alive here because, uh, you know... The fire don't do nothing to me. I got an infinite health thing, and I'm just gonna go ahead and just casually walk out uninjured through all these things. Look at this. Way too easy. <laughs> infinite health mode is way too easy. A C-Mode's 100% gonna patch this, guys. I can already feel it right now. Ask C-Mode 3089, please don't patch this, alright? Don't, don't do it. I'm pretty sure he can't, okay? But anyway, let's go ahead and go rob the museum and see what happens. Alright, next robbery, museum. Okay, museum is notorious for people loofing inside, especially this one person like Creecraft, I think is the guy's name, really likes loofing in here. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, just casually walk over here. You can see I just run through all these lasers, them don't take any damage at all. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and just come over here and rob this painting, because I know a lot of people oof when trying to rob these paintings over here. You can see I'm taking damage when I'm instantly healing again, and I'm just gonna casually just like uh, run over here like this, and jetpack out. Completely uninjured. Yeah, it doesn't affect me at all, okay? It might take me down to red health, but I pretty much instantly go back to full. Asimo didn't even catch this. We didn't even find this until like months after the ambulance came out. Okay, I think the ambulance came out like fall 2018 or something. But yeah, it's literally been a while. And I'm gonna go ahead and just come on over here, get myself my museum money, just slide right over there. And uh, yeah, so now the next robbery we go. Uh, somebody just tase me. Bacon, don't even think about arresting me. Of course, this bacon here arrests me. Just to show you, okay, I can get arrested all I want, okay, you can see, it's trying to like dab on me, like do some whatever stuff, pretty sure I still have that full health glitch. So it looks like jewelry store is open again, okay, we're gonna go ahead and try to super duper hard obby over here, I'm gonna go ahead and just get myself 5 dollars cash real quick, and I'm gonna just like casually walk through this obby, this is like the hardest one, it's like the one with like the glass on the first floor, so as you can see here, I'm not even gonna touch my space bar, all I'm gonna do is hold W and shift. And I'm just gonna drag my camera around here. And I'm just gonna casually walk on right through here without going oof, okay? Like 100% no oof. If Creecraft learns this glitch, he'll like finally never oof in the jewelry store again. But anyway, you can see I'm gonna stand over here and just get myself the last thing. And then we're gonna go on right through like this. And we're gonna walk right past this bacon boy. Too easy. I'm just gonna run right through here. <laughs> nobody ever goes that way. Like nobody does. Otherwise, you're like a for sure going oof. But guess what? Not pressing spacebar at all actually can like survive in the jewelry store. Except when people will arrest you. Because uh, now they're gonna try to shoot me down like they always do. But it's not gonna happen. I'm just gonna keep on healing. And I'm gonna sit back, relax, and just watch it like them try become tryhards and all that good stuff. Like because they can't oof me. And uh, yeah, so I guess that's basically it for uh, this the glitch over here. Actually, one last thing. I'm gonna try standing in front of the train with this glitch. 
And let's see what happens. All right, guys, I hear a train over here. Let's go ahead and give it a try. Three, two, one. Rip. <laughs> oof. Big oof. Thomas the train is a big fat cheater. He bypassed my glitch. Thomas, why are you cheating? I don't understand. So it turns out that this glitch only works against, like, uh, I believe, regular weapons. I'm not sure if I still have the glitch or not. Maybe it went away when I went oof. But I'm gonna go ahead and get someone else to try and, uh, you know, take me out. Come on, people. Everyone shoot me. All right. So it turns out the glitch does, in fact, go away if you do oof from the train. So whenever you use this glitch, as long as you do not stand right in front of a train, I think you should be good. I'm not sure about ragdolling from a large height. I think that might actually oof you. The glitch really helps against just people like combating you because like they do 30 damage and it'll instantly heal back up to full. So uh, yeah, I guess that's basically gonna wrap it up here. If you guys enjoyed this ultimate god mode in infinite health glitch, be sure to press like, comment, subscribe. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think and I'll see you guys next time.